All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a setup uh, slash no, just a setup and how to insert your SIM into the new iPhone 8 Plus. Let me just wipe it down. Uh, I will say this that it gets fingerprints pretty easily. You see, just touching it like that, it's a fingerprint magnet. But I guess that was expected with the all glass back. I mean, you can see it from here. It, I have to clean it off, and then as soon as I put my finger on it, a, f a fingerprint smudge right there. So there's that. So this is going to be the first time that I'm actually turning it on. So let me just go ahead and turn it on. Boot it up for the first time. And let's just let it run through the process. So as you can see, the it has booted up. So I think it's just uh, press the home button, and then you choose your uh, you choose your language language sorry uh, country United States uh, set up manually, and then I'm gonna find my. Wi-Fi connection and there we go um, what is my Wi-Fi password huh I don't remember let's see ah I got it <coughs> sorry about that guys I feel a little bit sick and as you can see I'm connected through the Wi-Fi phone came almost uh, around 80% charged with Bluetooth enabled okay so now I have to insert a sim so let's get that on the way so the sim is the one I had in the, my Moto Z play it's kind of tricky to take it off the Moto Z play but not that bad all right so this is my sim my t-mobile sim and let me open up the iphone 8 so i can pop it in there and as you can see it's right here on the side put your sim ejector tool slap it in there and you see there's no micro sd expansion or anything like that it's just basically your sim only so you're not going to be putting else expandable storage okay so the sim has been inside uh, press the home okay so I says no service so let's see what I can do maybe it'll try it again and it's searching for my sim or something hopefully it works I did buy this unlocked and I kept asking if it would work with any carrier. So, ah, uh, there we go. So let me set up Touch ID. Touch ID is pretty simple. You just tap on the thing, or tap lightly. See, just, there you go. And I'll adjust my grip a little bit. And just tap it, just, you're basically just tapping it a little bit and then as for the password what is that your sim sent a text message and I just used a, a pretty quick password now so I can show you guys one 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 and then I'm just gonna set up as a new iPhone because I don't want to have a bunch of other stuff that I don't even use I wanted it to be fresh so let me put in my uh, Apple ID and password so basically this has the same um, screen except that it has the new true tone display and it is LED uh, unlike the iPhone 10 that uh, is coming out in October it's 
pre-order October 27 and it comes out um, November 4th I think so now it's just trying to set up my touch ID and just put I mean my uh, Apple ID and my password I just set it up excuse my uh, voice um, <clears throat> I feel a little bit sick I got a sore throat sorry about that so customize settings I don't want to be able to track so disable location services yes and then I'll set up I'll pay later in the wallet and then I don't use the iCloud and I don't really like Siri and I don't really want to send them improvements and this is the I don't know if you guys will be able to see it but see without true tone see Okay, so, hmm, true tone display, I mean it makes it a little wider, because right now it looks a little warmer, and this just that makes it less warm, but true tone looks almost the same as, it's just a little warmer, but I'll change that out later. Me, make your iPhone experience even more personal by choosing the click that's right for you. Let's see. Choose to tap an option below then press the home. This is all new to me, so sorry about this guys. I'm just going through the setup process with you guys. Tap an option below then press the home button and give it a try. To set the one you like, tap next. Hmm. I think I like two better. It's like a happy medium. You just there. All right. So display zoomed. You have your standard and your zoomed. Uh, it, hmm. What is the big difference? I like the standard better because look at the zoomed. That's standard. Yeah, I like I like standard better. Makes it look like it's smaller. I like smaller text. All right, so this is here on my, on my, the home screen. Uh, I think you, yeah, you still got the 3D effect when you look around and stuff like that. And then you have these icons. These are all the preloaded apps on the, from the, from Apple that they give you the preloaded ones. And I see you have a voicemail already. All right. So I guess that does it for uh, this quick uh, setup guy. This is just basically to uh, let you guys know how to set it up when you guys first started and what you'll expect and uh, what you have to do with a sim. It does require a sim. Well, at least this model did. And this is just my uh, first setup guide. And I'll be giving you guys a, a first impressions and on the battery life, on the display, and a little bit of the camera if I'm able to take some pictures. So stay tuned for that guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for supporting the channel and I'll see you guys later.